Hi guys, in this video, we'll be seeing how we can use a uh, Lambda function to create AMI of this running instance. And also we'll be doing uh, use of CloudWatch to automate this uh, Lambda code so that we can create AMI for this instance uh, using a specific time or date. So I got everything ready uh, in this code over here. So we require a role first with all these policies. So I'll quickly copy these policies. Let's head over to IAM. and uh, create a role so this is the basic drill uh, we do this in, in each and every video i don't require this tab go to roles create a role use case will be lambda as the code which we are creating is in lambda now and here we'll enter all the policy that we require, check them all. Let's give it a name, AMI today, because I have practiced this so many times now. And a role has been created. Okay, that's done. Now let's head over to Lambda function and create a function over there. Mm. and create a function function name okay so the runtime will be js14 uh, code runs on it uh, let's use existing role ami today create a function now as you can see that uh, this is our code and uh, a code contains three tags over here that is daily backup daily backup retention days and backup no reboot so these tags are need to be mentioned in our instance also i will show you how to do that first we'll copy the entire code and let's hit okay now we have entered the code over here go to configuration edit make the timeout as one the role is over here hit save yeah, everything is done now so now only we need to set up this tags so let's head over to instance tags manage tag and we will add three tags over here so as you can see here in first is the retention days three I up no reboot. It's true. Daily backup. Yes. So what is this exactly? Daily backup retention days is three. That is after three days, this AMI which we which got created will be automatically deleted. This backup no reboot true. That is when the backup is created, the instance won't reboot. So we hit here true that uh, the instance will not reboot when the AMI is created and daily backup. Yes, this is self-explanatory. So yeah, hit save. Yeah, so everything is done. Let's refresh this once. Let's check our tag once. Yeah, it's there. Now let's deploy. Let's deploy test. Test create. Now let's uh, test this code. Yes, it is successful. Let's check whether we got an AMI or not. Head over to AMI. And you can check that the AMI is successfully created. You can check the date and time as well. I will show you it's 26th. Yeah, so this is how an AMI is created. So now let's go ahead in CloudWatch also and let's try automate are doing this so we go to cloud watch rules okay let's create a rule so we need to schedule it via using a cron expression so let's say uh, we want uh, what's the time right now it's 1915 so we want AMI every 730 
so let's check what is 730 in gmt 730 ist to gmt so it is uh, 730 no it's not 17 it's 1930 so you need to make changes according to 24 hour format so it's 2 pm so what is 2 pm 2 pm is around 14 so here we will enter 0, 0, 14. so we require this every day so star star question mark and star so as you can check every 26 27 28 every coming day it is going to take ami for us at what time exactly it's going to be 19:30 that is 7:30 and yeah so this is done let's add a target over here it is a lambda function what is the function ami today it's done we take a detail let's give it a name ami every day at 7:30 See, this is enabled. Create a rule. Mm, one validation needed. Okay, I guess the name are having some issue. So let's give it exactly so. And my every day, and let's create a rule. Oh, what is this? I guess there is some issue with this name, so we'll just shorten this up and not ami only and uh, the description you can write everything whatever you want there was something with the name so we have created this uh, cloud watch now so it's uh, 1918 so this will trigger at exactly 7 30 so i'll just unpause the video in time thank you so guys it's uh, 7 34 already let's check whether the ami is created or not so we are in emi section refresh this once and yes you can check at exactly 7 30 our ami got created so this is how you can uh, automate this process using cloudwatch so every 7 30 every day this ami would be there and after three days it will also get deleted so that's it for my side today uh, thank you for watching this video have a great day